Bugs. I am back with another video. Hey y'all, hey. It is Nicole Joe. I am doing another voiceover. It's just easier for me to do voiceovers right now. Um, you guys know I'm still pregnant. It's winding down and your girl is tired. But anyways, you guys, I hope all is well. Hope you guys had a great new year. I hope the year is starting off to a fabulous start. And I decided to review a Carol's Daughter product. You guys, I seen this product on Jade Kendall's Instagram story and I was like, hmm, I think I should check that out. So it's the Carol's Daughter Wash Day Delight. It's a love at first wash, water to foam shampoo with alloy. This is a natural product. It's no sulfates, no parabens, no silicones, no artificial colors. So this is a foam. Um, it's a water to foam shampoo. This is not my first time checking this out, but I wanted to try it before I actually did a review so I can get a clear cut review and a clear thought process on this product. You do get a lot of product for the price. I want to say I paid $10.99 or it was either $10.99 or $11.99 at Target for this product um, for 16.9 fluid ounces and a little bit definitely does go a long way. I will say that for this product. You guys already know I love clarifying shampoos, shampoos that really strip all the buildup, but doesn't strip the moisture. So that's what we're gonna be digging in today to see if this product will clean my hair but not strip my hair. Like I said, this is not my first time trying this product. I tried it before I got on camera and I do have a thorough and fully thought out opinion on this product. Comment down below, let me know if you guys like this product or not. You guys will see how my hair washes up in this product and I will come back on and let you guys know how I feel. Like I said, I did pick this product up from Target. I do think this product actually is at Ulta though. You can check it out at Ulta. I believe I paid $10.99 for this product. Like I said, you do get a lot of products for the price. This is a water to foam shampoo, like I stated before. So it starts off as a water and it definitely foams up. As you guys can see in the clip, it did foam up. You did see the foam. You guys, when I say this product definitely cleaned my hair, this product cleaned my hair very, very well. For somebody who has fine hair and doesn't like a lot of buildup, this product definitely did the job. Ideally, I think this product is for people who have oily hair though, because it does strip pretty much every moisture that you could think of in your hair. I will say this product is, it does exactly what it says it's supposed to do. It's gonna leave your hair very clean and very soft, but for me, it did leave my hair dry. Um, so if you have oily hair, I would definitely check this product out because this product will do the job. It will clean it. It will get you the results that you're looking for. But if you are more on the oily side, it probably will not leave your hair dry. <laughs> or as dry as mine was because my hair was super dry after this. I definitely did have to follow up with a very, very good deep condition because your girl was hurting. So comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of this product. Like I said, my hair was lightweight. It was very, very clean. It was soft, 
but it was just dry. Um, if you do have oily hair, oily fine hair, I would say go cop this, pick this up, check it out. It's worth a try. It does clean your hair. However, if you have fine hair that is on the drier side, you're probably not going to find this product very useful or you're probably not going to be a fan of this product. But anyways, definitely give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to check the girl out at Beauty on the Go with Miss Jo. And until next time, bye.